Hello! I'm going to show you step-by-step step how to deploy and manage a Zojo web app to your own DigitalOcean droplet using my new app, Lifeboat. First, we'll need a DigitalOcean droplet, so come to your dashboard and create a new one. Select one of the flavors that Lifeboat supports and a droplet size that suits your needs. Choose a data center and your authentication system. I've already set up SSH keys with DigitalOcean, so I can select them here in the dashboard. Give it a host name, and we'll be on our way. DigitalOcean will need just a few moments to set up our droplet. Now that we have an IP address, we can begin networking. Copy the IP address and edit your DNS records. We're going to create an A record that points at our new droplet. Importantly, we're also going to create a wildcard subdomain that also points at our new droplet. This will allow us to create subdomains in Lifeboat without changing our DNS settings. With our DNS saved, we're ready to go to Lifeboat. Create a new server and enter your authentication. On DigitalOcean, the default username is root. I've already set up my SSH keys, so Lifeboat finds them in the standard location. We're able to connect to DigitalOcean just that easily. Lifeboat has discovered that this is a new droplet and is offering to install the required components. Click Install and give it just a few minutes to complete. With Lifeboat installed, we're ready to set up our domain. Come to the Domains and Subdomains tab and create a new record with the plus button. Enter the domain or subdomain that your web app will eventually be accessed from and choose your SSL setting. Force will force everything to the secure layer. Enabled offers both a secure and non-secure layer and disabled will not configure the secure layer. Click Save and Lifeboat will begin configuring everything it needs. It will request an SSL certificate from Let's Encrypt, install it, and configure Nginx to listen for this domain. Next, we'll need to upload our web app. Click the plus button to create a new app and give it a name. Next, select a domain for the web app. This list will only show addresses that have not been assigned. Instances is how many instances you wish to run if you are going to load balance your app. I'm going to leave it at one. Drag in your web app and Lifeboat will attempt to find the main executable. Click Stage to upload your web app to the staging area. I have Lifeboat configured to automatically deploy. This means that once the web app is uploaded, Lifeboat will stop and swap the new version into place. The web app is now running on our server. And that is how to deploy a Zojo web app to your own Linux server.